Okay, in this lesson, I'm gonna continue doing the year. So in the last lesson, we had done this. So hopefully you understood the technique. And let's uh, let's continue doing this. So I want to fill this area. So let's take the append polygon tool. Just click here and here to fill the press or just right click or press enter. Then at the back side, the year is not this much of thing. It's kind of till this area. So let's extrude the back side from here, the connection area till here. So it, it selects this side, but I wanted to select this side. So let's select this manually a bit. So select and extrude. A selection is very bad. Okay, let's select. Select this. Extrude and move those in local axis like this. Something like this. Use the append polygon tool and fill this area and fill this area as well. So we are ready to freeze or merge this here with the head. Let's check some shapes there. This looks, this will go down. Better. And there's this shape. You can see so select this area and just put something like this okay so let's let's check how many edges are in the border to check that go to display hit sub display poly count so it will uh, bring this menu here so if i go to the edge mode and double click on the border edge i can see it's there are 15 edges so i need 15 edges in my head as well here so let's check here it's 24 it's uh, calculating both sides so each side is 12 so I have, I believe it's 15 plus 15 and I have 12 here. So let's put uh, some edge loop here. Let's add some edge loop. Go and put an edge loop here. This area and this area. So I'm adding edge loop where I feel it's missing or there are room to add. So now it's 14 and it's 15, right? So let's add another, or you can also decrease somewhere. Like if I can merge this two, I get a triangle, but I can fix that later. Before merging, make sure you rotate the air and get that proper angle like this then let's combine both and let's merge those freeze those double click on this edge and double click to get the edge loop then go to edit mesh bridge bridge only works when the both edge loop have the same poly count like mine so if it differs it won't work so keep it in mind you should have same poly counts here and here. Let's bridge. So it's showing there are again. I just told you that and I have done that mistake. It's 14 and it's 14 here as well. 14. The problem is 
let's merge this two let's see how many it's 13 and here I have 14 wow great so I need to bring one down let's see here let's combine and let's try again if it works this time I have same count it should work bridge yeah I don't need so many edges in between the bridge so just bring those down to zero I can put if I need that later so at this time I don't want so okay okay that's it for this lesson and I'll see you again